I've created a list of the top five entry level cybersecurity jobs that you could be pursuing right now if you want to build a career in cybersecurity. Now, for each one of these, we're going to go over things such as average salary, typical responsibilities, required skills and educational background, and the pathway to further career advancement. This will hopefully help you understand which entry level roles best align with your interests and career goals while providing you a clear roadmap to start your cybersecurity journey. And really quick, if you think you already know which entry level position you're interested in, let me know down in the comments below. If you don't, drop an emoji because it helps with engagement. All right, let's go ahead and dive into our very first role, cybersecurity analyst. Security analysts are responsible for monitoring an organization's network for security breaches and incidents. They analyze security data, investigate threats, and help implement security measures. Security analysts can expect an average salary here in the US of 70 to $80,000 a year. Now, if you're looking to land one of these positions, make sure you have experience in security technologies, system configurations, and a deep understanding of security policies and procedures. Now, while a bachelor's degree in a related field is definitely beneficial, Practical experience and relevant certifications can be key to securing this role. Most common career progression for a security analyst can progress into roles such as a senior security analyst, security engineer, or a security consultant. Now our very next role is security operations center analyst, or more commonly known as a SOC analyst. SOC analysts work in a security operations center where they monitor network traffic to detect and respond to security incidents to ensure the security of an organization's systems and data. Now while a position as a SOC analyst actually might sound very similar to a security analyst, the SOC SOC analyst actually focuses more on rapid response to emerging threats, while security analysts work on improving security measures. SOC analysts can typically expect to earn an average salary here in the US ranging anywhere from $60,000 to $75,000 a year. Most positions look for individual proficiencies in security monitoring tools incident response procedures, security fundamentals, and the ability to work effectively while under extreme pressure. While some employers may actually prefer candidates to have a degree, having relevant certifications in the cybersecurity field will definitely boost your qualifications when applying for a SOC analyst position. Now, a SOC analyst can typically advance into a role such as SOC manager, security engineers, or incident responder with an increasing experience and specialized training. Moving on to number three, we have junior penetration tester, ethical hackers. Junior penetration testers are responsible for identifying vulnerabilities in organization systems and applications. They conduct ethical hacking tests to find weaknesses that could be exploited by malicious actors. The average entry level salary for this job is 60 to $80,000 a year. This position definitely requires a bit more skill than our first two. Skills range from proficiency in ethical hacking techniques, knowledge of penetration testing tools, programming skills such as Python, and problem-solving abilities to name a few. As with most of these jobs, a college degree is definitely preferred, but don't let that discourage you if college is not for you. Having relevant certifications and expertise can definitely help you catch uh, the hiring manager's attention. Myself, I was able to get into the tech field with no degree, no certifications and no prior work experience. And within three years, I was able to promote up into a director level role. With that said, it was definitely extremely challenging. So having certifications or degree will just help that process move along. Now, junior penetration testers can progress into roles such as senior penetration testers, security consultants or security engineers, or a security architect as they gain more expertise and experience in ethical hacking and security testing. Coming in at number four, we have information security technicians. Information security technicians assist in implementing security measures, configuring security software and hardware, and maintaining security systems. They often work closely with more experienced cybersecurity professionals. The average salary for this position comes in at about fifty dollars to $60,000 a year. Requirements for this job tend to be less than others and tend to consist of knowledge of security technologies, strong troubleshooting abilities, attention to detail, and effective teamwork. Information security technicians can advance into roles such as security administrators, security analysts, 
or choose to specialize in a specific area of cybersecurity. Now we have your security administrators. Security administrators often focus on configuring and maintaining security tools and systems such as firewalls, antivirus, and intrusion detection systems. Security administrators on average typically earn a salary ranging from $55 to $70,000 a year. Some of the skills required include expertise in security technology systems, system configuration, and a deep understanding of security policies and procedures. Now, out of all the jobs we've covered so far, this one is probably the most difficult one to land as an entry-level person. Having entry-level certifications will definitely help give you a leg up when applying for this job. Security administrators can progress into roles like security engineer, security consultant, or even move into a leadership position such as chief information security officer. Now, I know the title of this video was the top five entry-level cybersecurity jobs, but I don't feel like this list would be complete without mentioning security awareness and training specialists. These specialists are responsible for developing and implementing security awareness and training programs for organizational employees. They create educational material, conduct training sessions, and promote best practices in cybersecurity to reduce human-related security risks such as phishing attacks. Security awareness and training specialists can expect to earn an average salary from fifty dollars to $70,000 a year. Strong communication skills, knowledge of security concepts, and the ability to convey complex information to non-technical audience and create and design engaging training material are some of the required skills to land this position. Security awareness and training specialists can advance into roles such as security awareness and training managers security consultants or end up broadening their expertise into other cybersecurity domains as they gain experience in promoting security awareness and education within their organizations. Now, all this information is great, but you might be like, where do I get started? Well, that's where the sponsor of this video comes into play. Coursera hosts completely online certificate and degree programs in cybersecurity. Professional certificates on Coursera are self-paced, 100% online courses designed to help learners acquire specific skills and knowledge. These programs offer flexible online training from industry leaders such as Google, IBM, and more, designed to help you get job ready for a high growth field in as little as six months. And if you find a degree is the right next step for you, Coursera also hosts bachelor's and master's degree from accredited universities in topics such as information technology, cybersecurity, and more. Whether you're working full-time, have family commitments, or in the middle of a career change, you can fit learning on Coursera into your schedule. Explore Coursera's free cybersecurity career guide, including many cybersecurity programs that you can get started today with a free seven-day trial. Well, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and until next time, keep learning.